Let's talk about password managers mm -hmm. and how those can be used. I know that's a huge focus for Cybersecurity Awareness Month this year. Yes. For the National Cybersecurity Alliance. Let's talk about that a little bit. Right. So in combination with having MFA enabled on all of your accounts where you can, right, because not every application or website might not have that feature, but it's really, really critical that you um, use a unique username and password on every every login that you have and that can seem daunting now that everything wants you to log in right and so I myself have over 200 accounts in my password manager so the best way to manage all of that is using a password manager so a password manager will allow you to have that username and password be unique as unique as it can you know oftentimes um, many websites because it's easy for them to just say use your email address so if your email address has that same password across multiple sites, then when that data breach happens, that's where threat actors can then leverage that across there. But if you have a unique username and password, the likelihood of them reusing that, we call that account reuse or account takeover, um, is, is diminished because it's not the same password. So if you hear of an organization that says they had a data breach, the first thing you want to do is go in and change your password so that way you're protected. But now imagine if you had that same password across multiple sites and that username and password has been uh, compromised, now you have to remember all the places where you use that, right? So, and I know it can be daunting and that's why we recommend using a password manager, but I always uh, tell people to start with your bank accounts and your social media, right? Those are your critical accounts where threat actors really kind of go after and try and harvest um, those credentials that can get them financial gain. Um, start there, but then now I've just gotten in the habit every time I'm creating a new account for some website, I open up my password manager, I'm putting in my username and my password, making it unique, and many of them will generate one for you. It, you know, it's not readable. And they also have browser extensions so that way you can have it readily avail available so that you're not having to key that in every time, right? And even my mobile device, right? It will let me choose, do I want to use my keychain save password or do I want to open up my password vault and pull the password from my vault? So that way it, it's user friendly, right? Making it easier for us to do the right things is what really helps people uh, stay secure.